Carlo in Glen Gardner, New Jersey writes, Hey Paul, I have a question based on something you mentioned about the FR-30s. <laughs> did, did I mention that they go upside down? <laughs> I have no clue why these, this pair of FR-30s is sitting in the warehouse upside down. Maybe they're working on something. I don't know. Aren't they cool? This solid metal base. Wow. Yeah, that's okay. All right. Anyway, I haven't received my copy of the audiophile's guide, The Speaker, yet. So this is just to share my curiosity until I'm able to use your techniques to hone my system correctly. You mentioned that the FR-30 has the magic ability to disappear in the room when set up correctly, of course. My question is, with stereo music, wouldn't you be able to hear directionality when sounds are played on one side versus the other? I get the idea of the soundstage. But then you're saying that from the listening position, you would not be able to tell that sounds are being generated from one speaker or another. Yes, I'm saying exactly that. And it's uncanny when you get it set up properly. So I'm glad you bought the Audiophiles Guide, the loudspeaker, the latest. Now, whether you have the Audiophiles Guide, the stereo, or the Audiophiles Guide, the loudspeaker, either one will help. The, the newer one, the Audiophiles Guide, the loudspeaker, which there's boxes of them sitting over here that we're starting to ship them now, and I apologize for the wait. That will help tremendously in getting your speakers to do this disappearing act, this magic act. And people really struggle with that. We were just at the Octave Records studios last night, late, and the artists wanted to come into the mix room where there's a pair of FR-30s and listen to what they had just created. And we put it on. They're listening and they go, oh my God, never heard anything like that. And the one musician, he was, I think he was the bass player, said, it sounds like everything is coming from those uh, wall things, the baffle things. There's no sound uh, coming from the speakers. I don't get it. And that's kind of the reaction that you get. So unless, so here, here's some variations. If somebody is really close with the microphone, if, if, and let's, let's say we had uh, a singer and we panned the singer all the way over to the left, okay? And that singer was very close to the microphone. Well, first off, that's a poor recording. <laughs> but if they're really close to the microphone, you, you would very likely hear it coming out of the left speaker. In that case, that recording won't help give you that, that sound stage. So not every recording is going to do it. The vast majority of recordings, huge majority of them, will. So most, very few recordings have somebody just literally on the microphone. If you just place it this far away, you'll get that. It, it, it takes it out of the speaker completely. And it's a combination of your loudspeakers. So the FR-30s we know are great at that. And that's because they have very flat off-axis response. So there's on-axis pointing right at you and off-axis, which is off to the side. Not every speaker does that. Some speakers require to be very far away, uh, very far out to the sides and pointing at you. And then you get this disappearing act between the two speakers. Okay, where on the FR-30s, they're closer together, pointed more straight at you, and the soundstage is behind and off to the sides. So those are the two kinds. Very wide, spaced apart speakers pointing at your ears, a beautiful soundstage unattached to the speakers in the middle, or closer together, slight angle toed in, and the soundstage is still the same size that you have in the other one, but it extends beyond the speakers, okay? Now, most speakers are able to do that some better than others. In the book, the audiophile's guide, the speaker, we show you how to do that, and, and you get the associated SACD, which will play in any one CD player, Blu-ray player, DVD player, doesn't matter. It'll play in it, and you, you use that to set it up, and I show you step by step, how to achieve that magic. And it's the best 60 bucks you'll ever spend. Seriously, it, it's, 
I, you know, I know I'm tooting my own horn here, but honestly, I've done this for years. I know how to do it, and I'm sharing my knowledge with, with you. And so I can't wait to see what kind of magic that you make. But yeah, it's entirely possible. And I cover both methods in the audio files guide, the loudspeaker. So I cover the, the, the far field and the nearer, closer ones like the FR30s. But whatever speakers you have, we'll be able to make some magic for you. Okay. Good luck. And let me know how it goes. Drop me a note. Appreciate it.